Dear friends, welcome back to a new video tutorial. Today I'll show you how I made this skeleton, terrified of a dog who only want to chew his shins. It's an automaton that I made two years ago, so one of my first automata ever. I made the first one in wooden paper match and I made it for an art competition. Unfortunately, I had made it with a belt and pulley mechanism, which don't, didn't uh, work very well. In fact, it broke after a short time. I therefore decided to make a new one since we are almost in the spooky season. For this project I decided to use wooden gears, which are much more effective and resistant. For this project I have to thank Algolazer, who let me try their laser cutter. For this work I have used the Alpha, a 22 watt laser diode, which worked really well and cut this 12 mm thick fir wood very quickly. This laser cutter has an integrated control air system, which improves the cut and avoids the formation of flames or burning the material on the edge of the cut, an essential feature for doing this type of work. It can also cut different materials such as felt, MDF, PMMA, plywood and can also engrave aluminium. In this case I took it a bit to the extreme, making it cut very thick fir wood and it cut it in a single pass, so it can work very well even with the greater thickness, without losing precision or efficiency in critical points such as the veins reaching resin or where the wood has knots. The laser can be connected to Wi-Fi and work with the classic laser cutting programs. I'm currently using LaserBar because it's the program I'm most uh, comfortable with. If you are interested in purchasing this uh, laser cutter, you can find the link in the description of the video. And by purchasing it, uh, you will support my channel at no additional cost. The product is very performing and uh, easy to use, and is ready for use after a simple assembly, which takes less than an hour. I started with the assembly of the base, which is made of a 12mm thick fir wood. Even the gears are made from the same board. I could have always done the holes with a laser. But since I like to change the project during the process, based on my taste, I decided to make the holes with the drill anyway.
This particular mechanism needs a weight to function correctly. I used a lead weight for fishing. Joining these two pieces was uh, very complex, because many components had to fit together at the same time.
Now I start to build the part of the skeleton. To make it I use the wax slats, which must all be drilled inside. To make the rope enter the holes quickly, I glued it with a tape to a piece of wire.
Now that I have finished the assembling the skeleton, I proceed to attack it to the base. It is a process that requires a lot of patterns, and everything must be adjusted very well to make it work correctly. I color everything with water-based acrylics. It would have been better to color before assembling the components, but since it is a new project to test if it works, I have to glue all the components. Thanks for watching this video. I invite you to subscribe to my channel to see new mechanical projects.